good lord, I look like I'm some sort of nerd in this man cave. And it's mostly because I'm, I'm filming on my filming on my bed because I sprained my ankle and it hurts like fuck to just stand. And sitting on my desk is also like, I mean it's possible but I just played it yesterday, let's just say it like that. And once it has healed a bit more, I'm gonna make more normal videos. Anyway, Mortal Kombat, Mortal Kombat 11 to be more specific, is the latest entry in the uh, famous video game franchise, which has been going on since 1991? I don't know. I don't remember exactly, but I remember like having seen videos about the controversy of it all. I mean, I wasn't even born back then, so yeah. That's my excuse for not really knowing when precisely it was released. Anyhow, uh, Jax, Jax is one of the main characters, and uh, as one of the main characters, um, he's uh, an essential part of the franchise. He's a black police officer from, I believe, New York? He was probably, if uh, don't quote me on that, introduced in Mortal Kombat 3 or 2, not in the first one, I, I would have remembered him. Uh, and uh, yeah, he got robotic arms, that's basically like his defining thing. Black police officer with robotic arms. And in the newest Mortal Kombat game, you don't fight Shao Kahn, you don't fight... Shang Tsung! Fucking hell, mate. Shang Tsung. Shang Tsung. So, yeah, Shang Tsung. Um, this time it's like some chick that can. A chick, dude? I don't, I don't even remember. So it's not important. She, she basically has like the MacGuffin of Time Manipulation, and um, if you win, you get the MacGuffin of Time Manipulation all for yourself, and you can create your perfect timeline. Uh, sounds great, is great, and like, I've, I've been watching like a, a compilation video where all of them were. I cut together and it's, it's entertaining, all of them are entertaining, however not everybody thinks that way, specifically because of Jax's uh, wish ending, in which he basically prevents slavery from ever happening. And that somehow got people real peeved and I have no clue as to how or why or what the devil and it was basically like oh yeah well it's what kind of wish thinking, <laughs> we was kings and shit. And I'm like, um, you know, if you have like the MacGuffin of ultimate ultimateness regarding all of time, I'm pretty sure it's not that impossible to create your own little timeline where black people aren't enslaved. It's not even, it's not even that they are like, oh, well, black people aren't enslaved and they become the leaders of the entire fucking world. No, it's all that I got from the from the little sequence was basically. Black people don't get enslaved, and they just have their own little lives, and um, they live along peacefully, if I even saw that one right, with white people. Which, I mean, um, is there a problem with that? Like, it's not that impossible, specifically if you got the MacGuffin of Ultimate Time, which, like... What is it that you don't understand about that? It's not like a Doctor Who, where you basically pull the, uh, um, oh, you can't do that because this is a fixed point in time card out of your ass every now and then. No, it's just that you can basically change all of time, and presumably even space. So, yeah, like, change a bit, something like, it doesn't even take that much tweaking to, 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 to realize this future. Just, for example, let the Dark Ages go on for a bit longer and have um, certain inventions come through later on. Or perhaps even have certain inventions be created in Africa due to some tweaking. Which isn't that big of a fucking like thing to do if you have all of time on your hands. That is like the thing that I don't understand. It's like different if you were to say, okay, uh, it's, it's regulated. You can't really like like anything before, I don't know, like 1500 or something, anything before that you can't change. No, you can change everything. And that means everything. Do you even know what everything means? Like, it's beyond comprehension, technically speaking. You can change an amoeba, you can change... You can create and destroy life. Like, what? How do you not understand that that would also entail the possibility of preventing slavery? Like... Of course, it makes no sense, uh, timeline speaking, but like, because technically speaking, he would need to have a reason to go back, but like, 
In this case, we're not talking about a logical explanation for time travel. What we are talking about is something way simpler. We're talking about the make-off of ultimate time and fucking space or shit. Yeah, it's just like, do you not understand this? This concept of like something that is a stupid writing device because everybody can just do whatever the fuck they want, but that's the fun of it. And that's why it makes sense because, of, of course, it would be hard to really have such a reality come into existence, but not impossible. Not over the use of a MacGuffin of ultimate time, basically. <laughs> <laughs> of 15 minutes of time. I, I just don't understand how this is even SJW. Like, it has nothing to do with SJW-isms. It's just like, wouldn't it be nice to quote the um, Beach Boys? Oh, the philosophers of the 20th century. <laughs> wouldn't it be nice, uh, like, if we just had this timeline where everybody got along and nobody tried to enslave or indeed enslaved everybody else? Is that such a complex concept for people to imagine, or are people really caught up in the idea that certain races are better than others? Which, by the way, yeah, that's that's like legitimately racism. I'm not saying like, oh, well, you're a bad person. I'm saying you are invoking racism as in the idea that races are separate, regardless of what. Like, it's not like um, I don't know. People can grow up under different circumstances and be treated differently and therefore certain ideas emerge or don't emerge because life is not that fucking simple that you say oh I'm, I'm born German or I'm born a Spaniard and because of that I'm better than everybody else which doesn't really work for example I am German but here's the thing uh, I'm not punctual I'm not very thorough in my work Specifically if I don't like that work. And I fucking hate Oktoberfest. I hate Bavaria. I can't stand those twats. I hate Lederhosen. There are certain things about my country that I bloody love. Like Beethoven, for example. It's a thing to love. Definitely. Like our countrysides are beautiful. And Rammstein is the best musical uh, example Germany has to offer, in my opinion. However, that doesn't mean that it defines me as a person. I got so many other things. Well, that is that is the Scottish flag. I like the Scottish accent. I try to imitate it every now and then. I'm not that good at it. But I like different cultures. And I try to model my life around certain ideas that mix up. So why on earth do you believe, honestly, that this ending proposed in Mortal Kombat 11 is somehow an unrealistic SJW wokeness in woker? Okay, I'm not, I have no idea what the hell I was trying to say there, but what gets you so peeved about this? I've explained that the MacGuffin of Ultimate Time is obviously going to enable you to do literally whatever you want. Change a few atoms around and you won't even have humanity. So, preventing slavery seems like a teeny tiny problem in comparison. Which is like odd that, that uh, people get pissed off about that and it's, it was a really fun ending. Like, almost all the endings were pretty much fun. Um, some of them were a bit boring. Some of them were rather beautiful, like the one for um, Liu Kang. There we go. Yeah, Liu Kang. I was talking about Liu Kang. Like, Liu Kang's ending was amazingly gorgeous. At the same time, something like Shao Kahn's ending was just fucking awesome. <laughs> um, yeah, I don't, like, why are people really pissed about this? Like, the only people who I legitimately could imagine being pissed about this are, and I hate to say that because it's going to make me sound like fucking SCW myself, are racists. Like, you, you were okay with everything else in the endings, like, no problem, not even, like, well, was it because it's a used to word woke? Is that it? Are you really that sensitive? For God's sake, you're more sensitive than the fucking the Donald subreddit. This is a thing that I need to mention, because I was banned from the Donald subreddit, not for anything, like, specifically bad or, 
or or um uh, what's the word for God's sake not for anything provocative it, it was like a minor pun so it was about it wasn't even about uh, Donald Trump himself it was about uh, Tucker Carlson and um, <laughs> the only thing that I wrote beneath a video about Tucker Carlson that was posted on the Donald was gotta love that Tucker Carlson that was all and I was banned a mere 10 minutes after that now let me just ask you in all fairness specifically towards the Donald subreddit <laughs> Who got thin skin? Who gets triggered about everything? <laughs> because that shit is just embarrassing. I mean, for God's sake, are you just that? Are you just that easily offended? Kakatarsen, that is that is ridiculous. <sighs> Never mind. Um. I haven't actually played a Mortal Kombat game ever since I uh, tried to... Actually, I played like the uh, emulated version of the first one for the NES, I believe, or was it for the Sega... I don't know. Not for the NES, for the SNES, if anything. Uh, but like, uh, they are entertaining games, and once again, I, I just... have no clue who could ever get offended by this kind of an ending. It's fun, just like any of the other... Uh, endings is hypothetical, most of all, and given the ability of the MacGuffin of Ultimate Time, which like I, it was like an hourglass, I believe, which is kind of lame. And the, 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 <laughs> the point that I'm trying to make is like, honestly, leave in the comments like what what your problem would be with something that is designed to basically be a genie in a fucking lamp. Because that's what it is. Let's just not fuck around here. If you can change all of time and space, which you basically can if you can manipulate all of time, then yes, you have a genie. And that means you can prevent slavery. End of discussion. And then I said, uh, see you around. Um, yeah. So Jax, knows to say Sonya already. Did she say anything about me? Oh crap, Sonya. I'll save you, Sonya, throughout world! Wait, Jax, give her my number!